I will try to bring back some clarity to the cityscape image and also add some warmth to the overall look. So first in Lightroom, I will try to remove the haze. To do that, in the effects menu, I will slide the dehaze slider towards right, which will remove the haze. I will try not to overdo it. I will stop around 70. Next to recover details in the darker areas, in the light menu, I will increase the shadows value to around 80. So after tuning only a couple of sliders in Lightroom, I will move this to Snapseed by directly sharing from here. First thing in Snapseed, I will tune the shadows again this time in Tune Image to further get more info in the darker areas. Also reduce the highlights a bit. Next I will apply more contrast to the foreground with the curves by dragging the upper part towards left which will brighten the highlights. Dragging the lower part right further darkens the shadows. This I will apply only on the foreground with masking. Tap the stacks icon on the top right, view edits and curves, then brush. With the effect not applied, I will brush it on the foreground. Tapping the eye icon gives you the visual reference on where the effect is applied. Next I will try to make the image more warm with some orange stone, again using curves. With a combination of red and yellow, orange stone can be achieved. Drag the red curve upward and the blue which is opposite to yellow downwards, then apply it. To give more pop to the image, I will apply the vintage filter with the preset 12 and default settings. With masking, I will remove the effect on the parts of the water and the surroundings. More contrast with curves, again applying it on the foreground with masking.
I will tune the white balance to remove the warm look just a little. This is just a personal preference. So here are the looks after each edit in Snapseed. Thanks for watching.